Now, uh, he steps into the circle because I threw across at him. He steps this way, boom, and gets under and pivots. Now, where's he at? What? And I'm going to bed, okay? We're working on cutting angles. Now, he ain't going to come back to here and get punched up by me. So, he's going to do that one more time. Well, he gets under, he smokes me, bang. Then he circles around behind me because now I gotta turn around. Hold on. Now I gotta come look for him and what happens then? What? He catches me again. Y'all understand what I'm trying to teach y'all? I'm trying to teach you not to get hit and make sure you land as many punches effectively as possible by cutting angles. Whether that means I step here and pivot or if I step over here and pivot, so that I get as many punches off as possible and then get around to their back so I make them turn around so I can land another shot. Because everyone understands. In MMA, how does this affect me? If I'm getting around this guy and I hit that, can you put those down real quick? So I take this shot on him, I take this shot on him, he goes here, go ahead and hit this leg for me. Boom. Boom. He's got, now he's got me down and look what's happening. I'm, I'm hitting the ground. So, you want to know why for MMA application, that's the, the very basic and least of it, okay? I would be firing on the back of their thighs. Why? Because that hurts. Anybody been kicked in the back of their thigh? How's it feel? Tell them. That front face is, is a joke compared to this back. That back thigh, woo! Any bruises I've ever had, Miss Carrie's ever had, any y'all ever had, you'll notice this is a little discolored. Back here is a nice, good, deep color. It's because we used to get hit here, okay?